How to make drinkable water. If the world is dead, the rivers are sludge, and your tongue feels like sandpaper. The rain's acidic, lakes are soup, and every faucet coughs dust. Cities are silent, but the buzzards, real chatty. You're 30 hours without a sip, and that bottled Evian you were saving, stolen. By raccoons, wearing boots. Time to make your own drinkable water. Start by grabbing an old plastic bottle. Cracked? Good. Authentic. Slice it in half with a knife or broken glass or your will to live. Flip the top half upside down and stuff it. Charcoal from a burnt out pizza shop, sand from anywhere that doesn't hiss, and gravel or shattered hopes, whatever's heavier. Layer it like you're building the saddest parfait on earth. Charcoal kills the nasties, sand filters the sludge, and gravel looks cool. Find a dirty puddle, a rusty pot, or your tears. Pour that through. If it drips clear and doesn't smell like death, you're halfway there. Now boil it. Over fire, hot metal, solar lens made from old reading glasses, boil it like it owes you rent. Steam rises, leaves the murder particles behind. Catch the drip in something clean, or cleanish. Here's the science, you beautiful mutant. Charcoal absorbs poison, sand traps muck, steam leaves the rot behind. That drip, that's pure H2O, the good stuff. No bottled water, no gods, no problem. Just science, trash, and desperation. Drink up, survivor, you're still in the game.